Good morning, you guys. Today is the day we are starting our RV road trip. And if you have no idea what I'm talking about, let me rewind a little and explain. Three weeks ago, we were watching YouTube when we came across Ryan Trahan's videos of him trying to cross the United States starting from a penny. But in the process of that, he raised almost $1.4 million, which was 14 million meals for Feeding America, which is insane. So of course I got thinking to myself, Hmm, how can I do something like this on my channel? And then it dawned on me. Introducing trying to visit all 50 states before I start my next period. And of course, once we figured out what the concept would be on our channel, we went ahead and DM'd Ryan, let him know what we were doing, ran the idea past him, and he wished us the best of luck. Thanks, Ryan. Now, when I came up with this idea, it was actually insane, and I had to do some persuading yeah. to get my entire team to say yes, yeah. but I finally uh -huh. got yeah, so all yeses. Okay. Skip for the ride. <laughs> Yes or no, Mindy? <laughs> yes, if I can come. Five yeses! Now, I'm sure you are all asking the question, why your period and why does that matter? Brooklyn and I are going to be raising money for period supplies for people who cannot afford them. And if you are a person that menstruates, you know how important it is to have products when you need them most. And the fact that there are so many people out there that struggle with this daily is something that Brooklyn and I wanna try and tackle, especially now that period products are in short supply. Please enjoy my red nails. Get it? Cause it's like a period. The nicer. Now this is where you come into all of this. For the next 22 days, we are going to be daily vlogging this trip of us trying to hit all 50 states before I start my next period. But while these videos are going live, we will also have a live donation link in our bio where brands, influencers, and you guys can all donate to help us try and hit our goal of $100,000. And just so you know, $100,000 equals a million period products, which could help so many people. Even if you just donate your daily cup of coffee, which on average costs $5, that is 50 period products that could help somebody out. If you are not in the position to be able to donate money, you can also subscribe to our channel and we will donate one cent per subscriber, which means if we get 100,000 subscribers, we are donating 10,000 period products. And an even bigger number, if we get a million subscribers, we are donating 100,000 period products. That's actually wild, y'all. There are certain amounts of money that can be donated that will cause certain things to happen. For example, if you donate $1,000, your name gets put at the end of every single video. If you donate 5,000, we give you a verbal shout out in the video. If you donate something crazy like 20,000, we have to spend the night outside of the RV. And the wild one, if you donate $50,000, we lose the RV for 12 hours and somehow still have to make it to the states we are supposed to. It's very crazy and the more money donated, the crazier it gets. After packing, planning, and three weeks of hard work, that brings us to now. <laughs> Hi. How are you feeling? Uh, tired, but excited and nervous all at the same time. <laughs> we all know you're coming. I want to go. I also should stay. How are you feeling? Excited, but sad because I'm leaving Dakota for the longest I've ever left him. And Finn, which I've left Finn for longer, but I'm also sad about leaving Finn. What do you think? Uh, I don't know. Let's see how long this goes. <laughs> okay, you guys, so now that we are on the RV, it's time to tell y'all what the heck the game plan is for the day. We are hitting five states today. We are going from Texas to Oklahoma to Arkansas to Louisiana and all the way ending in Mississippi. It's a big chunk. We are literally hitting five out of the 50 states starting on the very first day. I don't know what we were thinking. It's extremely <laughs> ambitious. We will see if we will actually pull it off considering we're also getting used to being in an RV. It's very bouncy. We are experiencing RV things we never knew about. I forgot my ID. So Dakota is meeting us here at Bucky's and we are Getting my ID. <laughs> it's a great, great start great to the trip. Stop, 15 minutes in. Hey, I, all I'm saying is, at least I figured it out now, and I, not in Mississippi tonight. I Hello. <laughs> Gotta get my Dr. Pepper. I love you. You just wanted to see me again. I did. It was my excuse. Bye, me. Oh, I'm back. I'm back. Hi, Stinky. I love you. I love you. Love you. Okay, I 
know you guys are gonna ask who's with us, so we're going to do an RV crew check. Let's go. Okay, this is Jeremy, my uncle, and he's driving the RV with us for a week. Okay, and this is Cameron McKnight, photographer and videographer. Anything to say? Uh, let's do this thing. Probably. <laughs> this is Brooklyn, AKA other half of the channel. Do you have anything to say? I just want to give a huge shout out to my parents. I want to just say a big thank you to... <laughs> anyway, moving on. And this is Asa, AKA my husband. Do you have anything to say? Hi, I'm Asa, AKA Bailey's husband. I'm just excited to be here. And I'm... Oh, you're so nice. Where is this good so nice. <laughs> so nice. Anything else? Nope, super proud of you. That's it. Okay, this is Sean, AKA another driver and my dad. Anything to say? I don't know how I always get roped into this, but let's end period poverty and let's eliminate the pink tax. Yeah, what he said. <laughs> and me. I have nothing else to say. Just me, Bailey. So, as we're sitting on this RV, we decided to post the donation link live. We are filming a couple days ahead. So we decided to post the donation link a couple days early. We just posted it and we already have six thousand over six thousand dollars dollars donated. We're almost a tenth of our way there. <laughs> and we're not even an hour in. It's mind blowing. Welcome to Oklahoma. Oklahoma. This is state, no, state, state two, two, I guess if I count Texas. A lot of people were asking if we're doing activities in the states that we are visiting, and the answer is yes, we will be doing activities. I don't know if we'll do activities in every single state, but we are doing one in Oklahoma, and it's going to be axe throwing. <laughs> Anyway, axe throwing was fun. That was fun. But now we're gonna find something to eat and head to the next state, AKA Arkansas. What are we doing in Arkansas? Absolutely nothing. We're gonna stop at the state line and fly our way to Louisiana so that we can visit with some of Ace's family because that's where he's from. You guys, I realized I said fly, but we are not flying. We are driving in this RV the entire trip. We are driving. Driving. I'm a little obsessed with this mic if you can't tell. Obviously not used to carrying one around. I present to you pizza from Oak, La Homa. I need to stop doing that. I didn't understand where it was from. The play? I mean, education. Oklahoma. Education. Like three Broadways and it's not one of them. Oak, La Homa. It's kind of, kind of addicting to do. That is a whole mood. A whole mood. The good old state of Arkansas. And I'm sorry for the people that live in Arkansas, but we are not staying. <laughs> we are going very quickly. <laughs> we got too many things to do, but goodbye. They just tried to, they stopped to make sure we were okay. That's nice. I love Arkansas. So obviously the title of the video says, I'm going to travel to all 50 states before I start my next period. I feel like I need to explain. Basically, I just finished today and that means we have about 22 days before I start my next period. I'm pretty lucky and have a regular cycle, so it should start on time, but that gives us around 22 to 24 days to essentially hit all 50 states. I don't even know if that's humanly possible, but we are going to try. I mean, I'd say we're doing a pretty good job considering we are hitting five states in the first day, but we'll see. And if somebody donates $50,000, that's gonna throw a huge wrench in the plan because pausing for 12 hours is just not going to be <laughs> plausible when you're trying to hit 50 states in 22 days. We'll see what happens. Anybody ever twerk on the side of a freeway? Cause I'm about to. 
Oh, uh, oh, okay. <laughs> Mom and Dad, don't watch. It's a little loud, but we are in the state of Louisiana. Louisiana! Asa's hometown. Louisiana. Been in the car for, I want to say, like, five or six hours. And we've already hit four states. We've been churning and grooving, but now we are heading to see some of Ace's family in Louisiana, because they live here, so why not? Let's go. I said to Brooklyn, I literally said, Mom, I was like, known. We should have known that her first instinct would be like, Dakota! I literally Mama. said to Brooklyn, Mom, yeah. Dad, I missed you, no Dakota! I knew the entire time because she can't keep any Not the from entire me. time. I texted her about three hours ago, I said, You liar. Plot twist! Mom's coming. What's up? What's up? What's up? Well, I was sleeping on the RV, so Hi, baby. this was a nice welcome surprise to wake up in Louisiana. How are y'all? Good, how are you? Thanks for letting us park here. Fun fact, this is the same exact place that he proposed to me. Yes. How long ago? Over a year ago. Over a year. All I remember is trying to walk in this grass in my heels. <laughs> Crying. And crying. Yep. Crying a lot. This is the bridge. Will you marry me? Yes! I will! Thank you! This is where yeah. it happened. All the way. Right over. here. This exact plank. You know that? No. Wait, oh, I thought you were being <laughs> serious. <laughs> this will always mean something to me because it's not only where he proposed, but it's also I stood on this exact same bridge the night that we met. So that. this bridge Lots is significant. Significant. It's got a lot of importance in my life. Yeah. Hello. Hello. This is my mom. Hello. <laughs> She's going to be driving for us on one of these weeks. Yes. Um, Can't wait. Do you have any advice for our first week of the road trip? Stay safe and yeah. stay in one piece so I can get to do the second leg. I'm excited. Great words, thank you. <laughs> hey Bob. Hey. How many days are there on average for a person with a period cycle? On average? On average. 42. <laughs> <laughs> That's my final answer. <laughs> How many days does a period normally last? Oh, this is gonna be so wrong. <laughs> can I can I phone a friend? <laughs> Just take a while, girl. Uh, nine. Nine? How do you feel? <laughs> I'm disappointed. <laughs> hey, can you blow kisses? <laughs> Show eat that. Hey. Boom, baby! We have determined at this point the coolest welcome sign has been Mississippi, which is our final state for the day and where we are going to be crashing for the night. We came at the perfect time. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Mississippi! Thought I was going to slide down the railing. My booty cheek's a little too sweaty for that. <laughs> All right, you guys, we are in Jackson, Mississippi, and we have just parked the RV for the very first night in the first RV park campsite. This is a little bit of a wild experience because I have no experience with RVs. Uh, don't ask me why I decided to plan a 50-state road trip when I have no experience with RVs. <laughs> we are in the process of figuring it out, plugging it all in, and then we'll be able to cook some dinner and go to bed first night in the RV. And just put it in and then the black ring should twist and hold it and kind of screw it on. Yep. Now it might be time to dump our poop. Not yet, not yet. I don't think anyone's I don't think we today. had to, no one's pooped in the RV today. <laughs> have you pooped? I haven't pooped in the RV yet. The poop police. Okay. So, this has like an Ace's tattoo. 
That ankle's there. He's got going on here. Is it real or is it Sharpie? Right here. You may never know. Find out in two weeks. Find out in two weeks if it's real or fake. Hey, first enter on the RV. How's everyone feeling? Good. How's everyone feeling? Good. Dad, how you feeling? It is 10.30, the very first night of our RV trip, and we are about to look at donations, see what the first day looks like. We don't know how much has been donated. We only looked at it for basically the first hour of donations, and that was it. So we have actually no idea. Okay, I'm excited. <gasps> Over $15,621. In one day? Obviously like every donation makes a huge difference because I'm scrolling and most of these donations are $10, $5, $25. Like it genuinely is just whatever you can give will help someone. Even a dollar is, you know, 10 period products for someone who needs it, so. Okay, now we're gonna do verbal donations. We it have looks like a list. The Let's only $5,000 donation today was from the McKnight family. We did it just because we were gonna kickstart the donations, obviously, and this is important yes. to us. So my mom donated yes. $5,000. So that's the only <laughs> verbal shout out we have today, but I do wanna give, it looks like our very first donor. Oh, it's Dakota! Oh, it's Dakota from his company for Bee Fruity. He has a smoothie company, so yeah. we, ha we had to give a shout, shout out to, to Dakota. Dakota. You're our very our first, first donor. donor. <laughs> that's, that's cute. That's that is cute. Really Love sweet. you, babe. Mwah. It is day one, so. So yes, there are many things time. that could happen. Every penny counts, and if you can't afford to, for some reason, donate yourself, we are gonna donate for you, so all you have to do is subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we will donate a penny per new subscriber, which actually doesn't seem like a lot, but it adds up quick, because even just 100,000 subscribers is, I think, 10,000 period supplies, which like is products, crazy. Which is actually wild. Also, I know, only because I've seen people asking, 100% of the donations go towards buying period supplies. Supplies. We do not receive any part of that, and it will only go towards buying superior supplies. Ooh, night one. Night it kind of looks like our normal one. bed. It does look like a normal bed. Today was insane. It was awesome. I will never, ever, ever get over the feeling of looking at day one. Day one of 22, and we're already at $15,000 in donations. Uh, Y'all are just awesome. It, it, Y'all are incredible for that. It just is so amazing to be able to raise money for something that I feel like isn't talked about and should be. Totally. And this is the perfect scenario to raise awareness for something amazing. And on that note, we are going to go to bed and start day two tomorrow. Five out of 50 states hit. Let's go. High five. High five. <laughs> he was leaving me hanging. I'm giving a thumbs up. <laughs> and good, good night. night.